Well, brands that could soon have a different kind of attraction to offer tourists. Good evening once again to you. I'm David Oliver. And I'm Heather Lewis. Thanks for joining us here at 6. This proposal could also answer a question many in the Ozarks have been wondering. What's going to happen to the Grand Palace? Well, that possible answer is coming up. This, a developer wants to build aquarium at the boardwalk at the old Grand Palace location. Color 10's Crystal Blair spoke with the developer of that idea today, and she shares tonight what the attraction will feature and the steps necessary to make this proposal a reality. Well, David and Heather, the, this was purchased by Cuvera and Company, Cuvera Partners out of California. They purchased that Grand Palace four years ago, and now they're ready to make it happen. Cuvera Partners also owns and operates Branson's Hollywood Wax Museum. So there's three parts to the pie. Tej Sunder, a developer with the company, says only the first phase of the project will be done using a TIF. So we are fully funded once TIF, if TIF is approved, to move forward right away. We listened through the last process of TIF, and one of the biggest concerns, and understandably so, was the idea that our neighboring businesses could get displaced by the aquarium. Sunder says they hired a marketing firm to address those concerns. We hired H2R to do a study to see what would be the impact of an aquarium come in here. We were very pleased that um, by bringing an aquarium, there would be some displacement, but all of that would be um, replaced by additional people we brought into Branson through either extending stays, um, coming more often, or new customers that we talked about before. And of course, when people think of aquariums in the Ozarks, what comes to mind is Springfield's wonders of wildlife. However, this developer says that's not quite what he has in mind for the aquarium at the boardwalk. We're going to bring different things. We're really going to focus on fun, interactiveness. His is wondrous with beautiful big tanks. Ours is going to be fun and exciting for toddlers to uh, parents. The city of Branson has hired a consultant to help them make the best decision. One of the uh, preliminary funding agreements is that we would pay for consultants through the city for them to be able to do uh, that kind of research so that the city of Branson wasn't footing any of that bill. Now, this project will be done in phases, and they're hoping to have it completed by March of 2020. The issue will be taken up again next Tuesday at the Board of Aldermen meeting. Reporting live in Branson, Crystal Blair, Color 10 News, Ozarks First. Crystal, thank you. More